Dozens of punches, kicks, and baton beatings. For over five minutes, three French police officers assault a black music producer in his own studio. The victim had stepped outside without a mask and returned to his studio to obtain one when he saw the police. But the officers followed him inside and, according to the victim, repeatedly shouted racial slurs while beating him. Michel has now filed a complaint with the police watchdog. I know they're going to do their job and that's all I want, for them to do their job. I was assaulted because they had authority. I didn't do anything. I didn't punch anyone. I didn't do anything. Michel, who never appears to resist arrest, struggles with the police for nearly 20 minutes in total. Though he was originally arrested for violence against public servants, after the video and photos of his injuries emerged, the charges were dropped and replaced by an investigation into the officers. The French interior minister described the images as extremely shocking. I've asked for the officer's suspension, and as soon as the justice system sheds light on what happened, I'll request that these officers be fired. They sullied the uniform of the Republic. This is the third investigation into police violence in less than a week. Amateur videos showed police tripping up and manhandling migrants, as well as beating a journalist during a protest in Paris on Monday. And it all comes against the backdrop of a law that would make it a crime to publish photos or videos where a police officer can be recognized if there's intent to harm. Though the law was validated by France's lower house of parliament, in the wake of recent events, Prime Minister Jean Castex has created a commission tasked with rewriting the controversial text.